Hey guys, there is this feature in Lightroom which will bring in all the details that is hidden behind the image that you have captured. Well, the best details that you can get is out of the raw images, but even if you have captured in JPEG or using your mobile device, you can still get these details. I'll be explaining this in simple terms and you don't have to be a genius to understand this. And this feature in Lightroom is super easy for you to experiment with. I know most of us will play around with the contrast to bring in those extra details in the image, but that is not the right way to edit an image all the time, but there are other ways to do that. So in this video, I'm going to explain step by step how you can do that. So let's dive into Lightroom. So open Lightroom and here I've got two images today, one from Bhutan and other one as of Taj Mahal. You can see this image from the Shula Pass in Bhutan and in the background is the Himalayas and also it's cloud covered. Well, there is this panel called HSL and under that we have luminance. If been when all is selected, you can see luminance somewhere at the bottom, but you can only select luminance if you want to play around with the luminance, which is good. So now if I want to change only the reds in the image, I can just move around the reds, but then you will have different shades of red, which is not perfectly red. So whenever you modify, say for example, if I'm modifying this sky, which is blue in color, but then it will only modify the blue, but not the other shades of blue. Especially if I want to modify the grass, which is green by default. And if I play around with the green, it won't modify anything. And it is modifying only the left portion of the image. So there is this button icon. And if you click on that, and if you drag it to the photo and move around up and down. Let me select that and then now move up and down you can see that it is actually the yellow and the orange that is making the grass. So it is not green. So even though it's appearing green for us, but, but the Lightroom says it is not green, it is yellow or orange. This small radio button is super helpful because it will highlight and show you what exactly is the color. And you can even modify multiple colors here. You can see that orange and yellow, both of them are being updated. The same goes with the next image that is the Taj Mahal here where I want to modify the sky and if I just edit the blues it will only highlight the sky and I want to bring this Taj Mahal in front and make the sky a little bit darker. I want that little bit of blue that is present in the sky to appear darker so that the Taj Mahal will pop up. So how do I do that? By increasing or decreasing the blue color or I will use this radio button and when I move that you can see that even the aqua color is coming down a little bit so that's the actual color that I want so now that you have watched this video will you be using this feature in Lightroom just try it out because you'll be super surprised to see the kind of details this feature in Lightroom can bring into your photo you can always leave a comment below with any kind of questions that you have got when it comes to Lightroom and also just let me know how you were editing your image to bring in these details. You may want to check this card to learn another feature in Lightroom or you may want to check this playlist that I've created where every tutorial of mine when it comes to Lightroom is put in one playlist. So guys, if you like this video, go ahead, subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit on the bell icon and just to keep me supported, you can even buy me a coffee. There's a link in the description below. Cheers.